Hello, inflation fighters. I'm gonna be showing you today what we got from our once a month pantry here. Um, I'm just learning about all of these things now. So, and I'm a little emotional because <clears throat> there was a lot of meat in this and um, we got, you know, some dairy and lots of fresh produce. So I'm gonna show you everything and then um, we will talk about um, something from yesterday that I neglected to mention. So anyway, let's look at the meat here. This is some pork ribs, chicken tenderloin, a whole bag of chicken breast, which we've not had in a really long time. <laughs> um, we got fish sticks and these are burgers. And four pounds of ground beef, short ribs, ground turkey, a beef Angus roast, ground pork, and lemon garlic chicken breast. Right there, sorry about that. <laughs> And then we've got some bacon that I'm gonna slice the package in half and freeze it separately. So we'll have at least two meals off of that. Um, we've got cheddar sausage here. that can be eaten like a hot dog or a bratwurst and with bacon inside. And then we have some smoked bratwurst here. On the dairy side, we got two sticks of challenge butter, some cheddar cheese, and some cheese slices. Then on the pasta and baking front, we got two boxes of macaroni and cheese, a box of suddenly salad, two packs of six boxes of raisin bran, pistachios, walnuts, egg noodles, and elbow macaroni. Now here, the produce, the amount just really got to me. <laughs> so we have some Anaheim chili peppers, which is great, because my husband really loves these. And we can use them in just about anything. We got frozen green beans, different variety of apples, four really nice tomatoes. They're very fresh. A pineapple, a whole cantaloupe, some cherries, eight corn on the cob, a yellow and white onion, two limes, two cucumbers, and kiwi, box of kiwi. Then on the canned food front, we got green beans, sliced carrots, mixed vegetables, and corn. And then we got these two packages of ready to heat and serve of beef stew and chili no beans. My husband had the beef stew the other night. He loved that. I thought it was really good. Uh, deep sea red salmon. A big jar or big can of star kissed tuna and water. Vine ripe tomato sauce. Vegetarian vegetable soup. Two cans of cream of chicken soup. Tomato soup, yellow mustard. This is another thing we didn't get from the other pantry, which was bread items. So here we have a whole bag of English muffins. Take them off there, I gotta tie that. Then we have multi grain farmhouse bread from Pepperidge Farm. 
cinnamon swirl bread from Pepper's Farm. Hamburger buns. Whole grain loaf of bread, 15 grain. Thin sliced whole grain bread. Farmhouse hearty white bread. And another Pepperidge Farm multigrain loaf of bread. That's really nice to have. I mean, we go through bread like crazy. My son loves peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. So, <laughs> And then on the snack front, we got wheat crisp crackers, generic Oreos, peanut butter toppy buzz, cliff bar, chewing gum, and sours. Nice to have some little treats. Then on the breakfast front, we have pancake syrup, complete buttermilk pancake mix, which is nice because sometimes you don't have butter, sometimes you don't have milk, sometimes you don't have eggs. So it's really nice to have that. You just add water. And a box of cornflakes. Peanut butter. And strawberry jam. Then on the toiletry front, we got two large rolls of toilet paper, two toothbrushes, and some shampoo. So that's it for the pantry haul here. There's so much and it's almost overwhelming. Um, a lot of peace from that. Um, one thing I wanted to mention uh, yesterday, which I forgot to do, was you can freeze cheese also. If you freeze it, it's going to become crumbly though. So if you have a block of cheese or um, things like that, you may want to shred it before you freeze it. Um, otherwise, if you don't mind crumbles, I mean, to me, what's the difference? It's just bigger shredded cheese, but that's, you know, my opinion. <laughs> anyway, I got to get these meats in the freezer. And um, so that is all for this haul. Be well, be blessed, and know you're taken care of.